Des. We are officially in conference award season and yesterday a WSU women's basketball player achieved a big accolade. Our Brenda Green sat down with her today. Charlie Sledger Walker won the Pac-12's Freshman of the Week award seven times this season, so it was a lock for her to win the conference's Freshman of the Year award. It was still an exciting moment for her, though, as her team heads into a pivotal week in terms of the NCAA tournament. It wasn't a big surprise, but it was just really cool to see the amount of support. How much support? The New Zealand native heard from people all over the globe when she was named Pac-12 Freshman of the Year yesterday. People who reached out include former WSU women's basketball players, players from other teams around the Pac-12, and her fellow Cougar student-athletes. My Instagram, you know how people repost you on your story, I had like over a hundred and I couldn't even go through all of them. I just, I still haven't gone through most of them right now. I'm just like doing it in chunks. No one knew of Ledger Walker when she signed with WSU this past spring in a conference filled with WNBA level players, including several heralded freshmen. Charlie knows her accomplishment is special. I'm just super proud of myself. Now I've kind of proven a little bit um, of what I can do. It's been awesome to see that, you know, I can compete at this level, obviously got so much to improve on and I think um, it's only going to get better, uh, you know, going up against these type of athletes all the time. That includes this week. The Pac-12 tournament starts on Wednesday and the Cougs need at least a win in the first round over Utah to solidify their spot in the NCAA tournament. We're definitely capable. We just have to go and go into that game with a, you know, really aggressive mindset um, and play kind of how we played at the start of the year and these last couple of games. Charlize is hoping that mindset can lead her program to the big dance, which they haven't been to in 30 seasons. She told me when she found out the Cougs had that long of a March Madness drought, it was mind blowing. It would be amazing for our team to make history again, kind of add to what we've already done this year. That would be awesome for our team and I'd just be so happy. A lot of pride. Um, and just a lot of joy. WSU and Utah tip off at 5 o'clock on Wednesday on the Pac-12 Network. If the Cougs win, they will play number two seeded and 11th ranked Arizona on Thursday, also at 5 o'clock on the Pac-12 Network. That's it for sports.